In this video, I'll be showing you how to capture events from a Polycom SIP phone to the PaperTrail hosted syslog server. This will allow you to see what's happening on the phone and also to get alerts in real time. All you need to get started are a free PaperTrail account available at papertrailapp.com, a Polycom phone running UC3 or greater firmware, and access to your SkySwitch provisioning server. Once you've signed up for the PaperTrail app and have logged in, go to Add a System on the dashboard. This will show you your PaperTrail URL. In this case, it's the highlighted text here. Next, go to the NetSapiens provisioning server and manage a specific device. Here I'm managing a Polycom VVX500. From the device edit page of the VVX500 inside the SkySwitch provisioning server, you will need to add several overrides, including the ones that I've highlighted here. For more information, visit the URL displayed on the screen. Saving these overrides will tell your Polycom phone to start sending logs to the PaperTrail syslog server. You can confirm that the overrides were correctly applied to your SIP phone by clicking the link labeled CFG2. This will bring up the page showing all of the overrides that are sent to the phone, including the syslog overrides that we just added. Now, reboot the phone by clicking the resync button. This applies all of the new settings to the device. Once the device resyncs, come back to PaperTrail, click on the dashboard, and locate the IP address of the device. Here, it's 192.168.10.179. Clicking on this IP address will bring us to all the events from this device. As you can see, the system is sending SIP as well as other events. Now that we know that the SIP phone is sending all of its events to the Paper Trail app, we can set up alerts. That is done by creating a search in the Paper Trail search box. Here I'm going to search for all events that include the text register. Okay, so here we have some results. And now I can save this search, give it a name. and click set up an alert. There are several different types of alerts available through the Paper Trail app. You can see them listed here, including email, chat, and several dedicated graphing and metrics services. In this case, I'm just going to use email. And I'm going to say I want alerts sent at one minute intervals, and the recipient will be the email address that's placed here. That's all there is to it. Coming back to the Paper Trail app dashboard, we can see the event that was just created. And now, if we come back and re-register the phone, we see that the event did create an email and that the email was sent to the email address specified. That's all you need to know to set up event monitoring and logging using the SkySwitch device provisioning server, a SIP phone, and the PaperTrail app.